do you at this second global symposium on health systems research really believe that research is a good thing always and forever? Because one thing we can say about the future is that our collective threats and how we address those are going to depend upon unprecedented cooperation between nations, between individuals, between institutions. But in a paper that was published very recently in Nature, a much more interesting journal than The Lancet, by the way, uh, in September, Martin Nowak's group uh, had a warning to the research community, one that we should pay attention to. And his warning was this, stop thinking, or at least, or at least don't think quite so much as you do. Because the finding in his paper that was entitled Spontaneous Giving and Calculated Greed was this, the cooperation amongst us, so critical to solving our global problems, is diminished by too much thinking, reflection, and debate. If we truly want to create the conditions for cooperation, his research found, the way to do that is to have the courage to make and take decisions to act, sometimes intuitively. So a message to the health systems research community might be, yes, research by all means, but don't forget your evolutionary obligation to act, and to act quickly, based upon your instinct, conditioned perhaps by research, but together now for our common good. And so here, very modestly proposed, is a manifesto for your new society, Health Systems Global, one that is perhaps tuned to post-2015. We, the health systems research community, are committed to the remoralization of our science, to act now based on our skills, our science, and our successes, addressing the most important predicaments facing our peoples and our planet, based upon our shared principles of human rights, equity, and social justice, taking our work directly to decision makers, holding them and ourselves accountable, recognizing that science is political, not only a technical process, and that we, Health Systems Global, are embracing advocacy and politics. We are scientists, we are activists, we are dedicated to the universal values of life, liberty, and health, now and post-2015, for a better world, a fairer world, a more harmonious world. Please thank our panel for a fantastic session.